Hey everybody. It's that time again. You know what time it is for a unboxing. We have two boxes. So I'm gonna open up mine first and then Rich is gonna open up his and then we can compare and see whose is better. You guys judge in the comments. The answer is my box. No, no, never. It's never been your box. Not even once. So let's see. I have no idea what's in here. Tales of the Teen Titans Annual number three, my favorite comic ever. Oh, is it? <laughs> and Sports Now. Wolverine 3, I'm a huge Wolverine fan. This is from his ongoing, or unlimited series. Uh, 98 white pages. Wolverine's awesome, so already looking pretty good. We've got Wolverine number five, speaking of Wolverine, just about to drop in from the uh, the trees on the uh, on these guys that are up to no good. Oh, nine eights so far. Well, nine eights. Feeling nervous? A little bit. Wolverine 75. This is the first time it is revealed that Wolverine has bone claws after his adamantium is removed. X-Men 1 Special Collector's Edition, which means it's the gate folds, the cover folds out and it wraps around. Oh, and how about an X-Men 10? Long shot, striking a pose. How about X-Men Deadly Genesis? We've got Zombified X-Men. Uh, Redux of Giant Size 1, so it's a really cool cover swipe with an Aeon Flux out on the back. Wow! Amazing <laughs> Spider-Man 378, the 98 white pages. Uh, this is a great cover by Bagley where you have Carnage and Venom. And then I've got Batman 497, Bane breaks Batman's back. All black, hard to get in high grade. We got it in 98. How about New Means 18, first appearance of the new Warlock and Demon Bear. Demon Bear. Uh, Silver Surfer, Volume 3, Number 46, Ron Lim, Sacramento Local Spawn, you got Spawn 158. Um, kind of a low print run on this stuff for sure, and a dark cover, hard to get in high grade, we got it in 9.8. And then I've got Wonder Woman 38, Lois Lane appearance, Whoa. for you Lois Lane fans, and you've got Wonder Woman battling uh, serpents, this is a Perez cover. Wonder Woman 41, awesome profile, uh, very like somber with the um, blood orange-ish. Similar to that Moon Knight from the other day. 98 white pages, so very cool. Wonder Woman 44, <laughs> that's how I start my day. Bursting out of rubble and fire. Uh, X Factor 92, 98 white pages. First appearance of Exodus. Again, part of the Fatal Attraction storyline. They all have the uh, hollow foil cards. And a really cool wraparound cover by Joe Custada. All right, <laughs> X-Men 1. Uh, so this is the X-Men Volume 2, number one. Again, this is part of the Jim Lee um, run, and this is the Magneto cover. X-Men number one, this is the cover with Colossus, Rogue, Gambit, and Psylocke. We've got the Trifecta, we've got the Cyclops, Wolverine, Iceman cover. Yeah, so. There we go. There you go, they all match up. Wow, you gotta have three hands. Go. All, right. all right, so top that ridge. Well, we just saw Wes's box, but now let me open up my better box because my box will be better. All right. Here we go. go. <laughs> uh, we got some classic uh, cardboard protection. We don't see that in every CGC box these days for some reason. Oh, look at this bubble wrap. There's like all the bubbles are already like popped except for this one row right here. Invoice. We've got Batman uh, 408 in a 9-8 white pages. Ooh, Joker appearance. And, uh, young Jason Todd. So, uh, you know, this is a really cool cover where he's trying to steal the wheels off the Batmobile. Batmobile lost a wheel and Joker got away. Hey! Anyways, I gotta move on. Oh, here's another. Oh, looks like uh, this is a pretty good box, Wes. Uh, Amazing Spider-Man Annual 21, the marriage of uh, Spider-Man, Peter Parker, and Mary Jane. Uh, special wedding issue, wow! Nine, six white pages, little, little uh, Spider-Man in a heart shape that would become popular for Mary Jane t-shirts later on down the road. Ooh, what's this? If you like that, you'll love the same book but in a 9-8. And if you like that, you'll probably love Amazing Spider-Man 375 in a 9-8 white pages. Really cool Spidey and Venom cover. And if you like Venom, then I like you. <laughs> if you like that, you'll like the same book in the same grade. Amazing Spider-Man 306, an obvious homage to the first Superman appearance, Action Comics number one. Yeah, Action Comics number one cover homage. I beat you to it, CGC. Firestorm number one in a 9-4 uh, white pages. Origin and first appearance of Firestorm. All right, Detective Comics. 
Oh no, Batman holding a gun. Batman year two storyline, this is year two part two. Year two is not considered as good as Frank Miller's Batman year one. McFarlane cover, really cool. Yeah. Batman with a gun, everybody. So, you know, Zack Snyder didn't start that, that's all I'm saying. How about the same book in the same grade, Detective Comics 576 in a 96 white pages. Marvel Superhero Secret Wars number 10, really cool Doctor Doom cover, he's kind of just like falling apart. Infamous Iron Man number one, this is when Doctor Doom kind of took on the uh, Iron Man persona, this is really cool, The Rise of Doom. Miles Morales Ultimate Spider-Man number one, 98 white pages, really cool Miles cover. Spider-Man 2099 number one, Origin of Spider-Man 2099. How about Spider Gwen number one in the 98 white pages? You got speaking more of into the Spider Verse. You know, here's Spider Gwen for all you Spider Gwen fans. I'm a big Spider Gwen fan. Not her first appearance. Not her first appearance, but it is her uh, number one issue. Uh, Moon Knight, 38, last issue. Wow. And the dead shall rise. My favorite, Web of Spider-Man number one in a 94 white pages. We've never seen this before. No. no. Lethal Protector, number one, first Venom in his own title. This is the beginning of his limited series in a 9-8 white pages, and this is a key, I promise. <laughs> and then we have Star Wars Fitty in a 9-6 white pages. Darth Vader, Yoda, Obi-Wan, Kenobi, Klisk, Donatello, a bunch of Star Wars names. Did you say Donatello? Donatello, Donatello appearance, no. Uh, it's Donna... Domina Tag, or Domina Tag, you know, Star Wars names. If you like that, you'll like the same comic in the same grade. <laughs> a Spider-Man 2099 and a 96, see that's what I'm talking about. We usually get these in a 96, but I pulled a 998 or out. I pulled out a 98 earlier. Okay, well that's the end of my box. Who won, me or Wes? I have a bad feeling Wes's box was actually much better. I love all the the X-Men stuff. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to give this video a like because YouTube doesn't know we exist unless you give us likes. Algorithm problems. Anyways, I'm Rich with A1 Comics. Bye-bye.